Hello and welcome, it's Fisher Fadel with lovelycourse.com as we continue our journey into project management. One thing that's very important in our project is we're delivering. Let's, let's think about it as we're delivering a new software, for example, or a new app. So we need to figure out what is so valuable about this app? What makes it more different? What makes it better than other apps that are out there? Are we really bringing something of value? So in the case of this, this is where the project manager is involved in what's called SWOT analysis, S-W-O-T. SWOT analysis. S is short for strength, W for weakness, O for opportunity, and T for threats. So whenever we have a project, whenever we're delivering something, we want to make sure we do what's called a SWOT analysis. Find the strength, the weakness, the opportunities, and threats. So when we talk about strength, what are we talking about? We're talking about factors within the project or organization that are helpful to achieve our objectives. But then we have weaknesses. What are our weaknesses? They're factors or constraints of the project organization that are harmful to achieving the objective. Strength, what's gonna help us achieve our objective for the project? Weaknesses are, what are certain things that could hinder us? Maybe we don't have enough people in the team. Maybe we don't have enough resources. Strength, oh, we have this technical skill. We have this platform. We have this whatever. Uh, opportunities. Opportunities are external conditions that are helpful to achieve objectives. And then finally, threats are external conditions which could hinder achieving objectives. So when do we usually do the SWOT analysis? Or why do we do it? It's because it can help us understand our business and how it's positioned in relation to the market and our competitors. So we can use the SWOT analysis for, for example, our brainstorming sessions, our business planning, our strategic planning, our competitor evaluation, our marketing proposals, our product development, our business reports, okay? And now to give examples a little bit more into it, let's talk about some of the strengths that we could have. Some of the strengths would include such as, what do we do well as a company, as an enterprise, as the project we're working on? What do our customers say we do well? What is our unique selling proposition? Do we have strong brand awareness, customer loyalty? Supplier, distribu uh, distributor, influencer relationships. What, what are our strong capitals? Do our profit margins compare to the industry benchmarks? So those are good things that we can consider as we're studying our strength. Our weaknesses would be things and, and questions that we could ask to build that would be, where can we improve? What do our customers frequently complain about? Are we new or not well known enough? Do we suffer from cash flow problems or debt? Are our profit margins smaller than industry benchmarks? Next are opportunities. How can we analyze opportunities? By asking questions such as, do our competitors have any weakness we could benefit from? Is there an untapped pain point or niche market for what we're gonna be selling? Any new technology that could benefit from us? Social or political trends that could benefit us? So those are all opportunities. When we talk about threats, there are certain questions that we could ask, such as new competitors or expansion in existing competitions. Huh, that could be a threat for us. Social or political trends that could work against us. Any new technology that could work against us. Is our target market shrinking or shifting? So those are threats that we need to consider. So this kind of summarizes SWOT analysis. And so to complete this course or this lesson, simply go to lovelycourse.com, lovelycourse.com. And then once you're in there, scroll down and go to project management, log into your course. Once you log in, we're gonna scroll down to SWOT analysis, SWOT analysis. Once you go into that lesson, you're gonna see the entire notes. You're gonna watch this, the videos that are involved in there. You're also gonna have some templates so you can download some of those notes. And if you need to use it, you can use it. Sample questions that you can use in your SWOT analysis to make your life much easier. Comparisons of strength and weaknesses. So a lot of details that goes in there. In addition to that, in the same course, you can scroll down all the way to the end and you're gonna find practice exams for the certification. Log it in there. You're going to be able to take some of those quizzes. It's pre, it's it's multiple choice, which means if you have the right answer, it's going to tell you it's the right answer. If you get the wrong answer, it will show you what the right answer is, and then you could retake the quiz as many times as you want until you're ready for the certification exam. Finally, just visit us at lovelycourse.com, 
and you'll be able to join the events. We have free events. So click on events or go to lovelycourse.com slash events and whatever event that interests you, it's absolutely free. Please join us. Or you can also come and ask any questions that you might have. We look forward to seeing you and thank you so much for your valuable time.